Sometimes, when you go to mark an estimate as complete, the estimate inspector appears and requires changes before the complete process can be finalized. Both the Mark Complete button and the Estimate Inspector are found in the Estimates Required tab. If the inspector has found issues, a red warning appears in the Estimate Inspector section. An inspection can be started manually at any time by clicking the Inspect button. An inspection is also run when the Mark Complete button is pressed and when generating reports. Open the inspector with the Inspect button. The first type of inspection error is missing information. If information is missing, errors will appear on the right under the required fields group. As the required data is entered, the red exclamation points change to green check marks. The estimator also frequently flags items that may be errors or inconsistencies in the estimate. This may include duplicate items, extra quantities of removal, or similar scenarios where the items conflict. These types of errors will be shown under the Xactimate Inspection Results section. As you select an error from the list, a description of that specific error is provided in the Instructions section. For example, here the message is telling us that quantities for the baseboard items exceed the floor perimeter of the room. As we look closely, this is because both items are billing for the removal of the baseboard even though it was most likely only torn out once. Remember that the AND activity code stands for Remove and Replace. Errors like this can be corrected directly in the inspector without needing to go back to estimate items. Select the item that needs to be removed or modified. In this example, either deleting the water removal item or changing the activity code on the regular baseboard could resolve the issue. Since the baseboard removed was wet and unsalvageable, in this case, we'll change the activity code of the regular item. To do this, select the item that needs to be changed, then click Edit. This opens up a quick entry pad that allows for changes. Change the activity code from Remove and Replace to Replace Only. Click OK. The items that were causing issues are removed from the inspection list, and the red exclamation point is replaced with a green check mark. Occasionally, you may find an inspection result that isn't actually an error. In this example, the inspector is giving an error that the number of doors being replaced is fewer than the number of lock sets being purchased for the estimate. In this case, the kitchen has two exterior doors with lock sets, but only one door was damaged during a burglary. The homeowner is requesting that the contractor replace the second lock set so that the new keys will be the same for all the doors. By clicking the checkbox beneath the item list, the red exclamation point goes away and a green check appears. Remember to always add a note explaining why the inspection results should be ignored. Once the inspection has been done and results have been corrected or ignored as needed, click Finish. The warnings in the Estimate Inspector section is replaced with a success message and the estimate can be completed. Click the Mark Complete button to change the estimate status. You may be prompted to resequence the line numbers. And that's how you can use the inspector and mark estimates as complete. Fill out the survey below to let us know if there's anything you'd like to learn more about. And be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more expert tips each week.